Hi, it's Jesse Zeman, Executive Director for the BC Wildlife Federation uh, member update for this week. First things first, great AGM and convention. I'd like to thank the whole team at the BCWF. We'd like to welcome our new board members and new executive members on, and I'd like to thank our former board members and executive members for their service over the last couple of years. Uh, exciting times, really looking forward to getting to work with you all. Uh, online auction went well. Uh, really well. Anybody who hasn't bought their 50-50 tickets with the BC Wildlife Federation, we'd encourage you to do that. In the uh, good news front, Bill 4, uh, a number of the pieces of that legislation, we received an email last week from the minister's office saying he was going to put a hold on some of the regulations, particularly the one related to um, increased uh, essentially oversight and management of ranges, which would require our ranges to hire staff to check people as they come in and out. And of course, as we know, a number of our ranges are remote. They don't have a lot of members. They're volunteer run. They're safe ranges. They are well taken care of. And at passing those costs onto the membership in a number of cases just simply isn't viable. So uh, again, common sense outcome. Thank you for all the work that the clubs did and that the board did advocating for this. And this is a good outcome. Uh, the next one is Region 7B, the proposed reduction of moose hunting, 50% uh, reduction in harvest and closure of caribou hunting. A decision is imminent, but please keep on it. Keep sending your emails, keep meeting with your MLAs. This one is really important for us moving forward. We need to make sure that we're taking care of treaty rights and also managing wildlife by science. Um, and then the final one, we just did a presentation today for two hours. Um, through the uh, Fisheries and Oceans Standing Committee talking about the use of science and DFO. We presented with a number of other um, folks from First Nations organizations, Pacific Salmon Foundation, Watershed Watch. Everyone had the same message. DFO has great scientists. DFO science is not getting to the top of the pile. So we need to continue to focus on the minister and on rearranging or reorganizing DFO so that we ensure that science is what's leading decisions and also that science is getting to the minister. Thanks for all that you do. Have a great week.